Hey guys, so just went to a follow-up appointment for Josiah's knee that was cracked from playing basketball. He ended up needing a cast and crutches. I had a call out for today um, just because I wanted to be there for him his first day. Um, plus we didn't end up getting home until almost 12 anyways because we had to go to the physical therapist and um, we had to schedule an MRI appointment and it's just a lot um, my mom has Dominic and Lily is in school but I was not expecting that um, yeah I was, he was just saying that it hurt a little bit um, something happened in school a couple weeks ago he was playing basketball at recess and he fell on it he said it hurt a little bit, but he was still walking and playing, and he didn't complain about it all the time. But I was like, I better take him in anyways, and I thought they were going to say maybe wrap it with, like, like one of those little wraps that sometimes athletes do, or elevate it, or wrap. even his doctor that saw it last week, oh, even his doctor that saw the crack was like, oh, he probably won't need a cast, he'll probably just need, um to elevate his leg and to rest but this we went to an orthopedic a specialist and they recommended well not recommended they said that he uh needs crutches and a cast for about six weeks um huh four to six weeks yeah i'm gonna get him into football this season um because everyone was saying how dangerous football is and i'm like i want to wait till he's older because um, I was, I'm just nervous about football, so I don't know if I want him doing contact sports. But what do you know? He ends up getting an injury playing basketball at recess. So uh, that's, that's crazy. But he's he's a tough kid. He's doing good, and he got to choose his color: orange Syracuse, right? And you got McDonald's. Now tomorrow he is going to go to school. I'm nervous. Um, I'm glad we talked to the, like, the office we go to has everything right there. The MRI, um, the x-rays, the, um, the doctor's orthopedic office, the, the cast place where they put the cast on. And then they had a physical therapy room downstairs that we saw before we left. They taught him how to use his crutches. And I'm so glad because he was kind of, like... Um, a little winded the way he was using them. He was like going like this and then swinging his legs And he was so winded and that would have been so hard So she said his is a minor weight. He can put some weight on it um, But just not all so he can like walk a little bit on it Which is which is nice and helps him a lot more than how he was walking um, So that was good but yeah, he probably can't play basketball season. So we'll have to make up for it in the summer. And, or not. Yes, the, I can. Well, you'll have to think of another sport to do. You'll have no, to. I can play basketball. Honey, even after you get your cast off, you're still going to have some restrictions. You know what I mean? But um, I'm going to get off here and I will update you guys a little bit later. Good Saturday morning, y'all. Yeah. Hey, I already have makeup on and things like that because my mom is coming over. Um, I'm going to see about refinancing my car today, so we're going to see what they say. I'm um, sorry, uh -huh. I haven't picked up the camera. <laughs> I've been completely slacking. There's been a lot that's been going on, obviously. There's Josiah. <laughs> Lily had her first field trip. <laughs> yeah, but I also have to go to the the word today um i need some food and i need to pick up a shower cover for josiah's cast um so yeah just like 
I'm going to go to that appointment, and then there's a ton of cleaning we have to do at, like, laundry. Um, but I'm going to get ready and cook the kids breakfast. I love Saturday mornings because they play with their toys for, like, three or four hours before they even ask for shows. You know, an hour before bed, they're on their shows. So... I like mornings like that. <laughs> Dominic put his Spider-Man in the Barbie house. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, guys, I got a headache too, so I'm about to pop me some Advils. I'm not showing their bottom part because y'all know it's Saturday morning, so they don't really got pants on. He's got a diaper. Lily's. Yeah, Josiah's just got shorts on. <laughs> So, I'm going to get him up and walking in a minute. I already put clothes away while the kids played upstairs earlier, too. So, that was, that was nice. Because that will... Shall get started. But, yeah. I um, haven't been vlogging lately. But, I will try and get back to it. Um, I actually saw these coupons in the mail. The kids do actually need some new coats. Lily and Josiah are probably good on coats, but Dominic needs a new coat. And they definitely need boots, and I kind of need a new coat. Um, and then I got the Sam's Club coupon book. Um, I told Lily to look at We got this Best Buy book for toys, and I told her to look at it. Did you see anything you liked? Yeah. Probably. Yes. No, I didn't get it for you. It came in the mail. But I just wish they had more food items. Ooh, that's... Yeah, but I need a pen for my grocery list, Lily. Oh, that's nice. They don't have a lot of... Ooh, the security. It's the holiday blend, y'all. hurt me a did several times it hurts to admit that we're no different i find it hard to commit but you don't even try still i'm better with than without you oh grocery haul I did was at Sam's Club or the last groceries I got were at Sam's Club and then like like little mini things I had to get here and there but I haven't filmed filmed any of that oh my god I can't talk today um just because there was a lot going on but this time it is a pretty small grocery haul um I had I have to get my car fixed and that's gonna cost a lot of money so I just got them some of the stuff that we need. Now, I still have ground beef in the fridge. I still have um, snacks from Sam's Club, so I didn't get a whole lot of snacks. Um, but I definitely needed some more things, so let's just get right into it. And this was all only $60, and I did do the Walmart grocery pickup. I know, I know. I said, I kept telling myself... I am not going to get into that trap. I like going grocery shopping. <laughs> but let me tell you, it does come in handy. With Josiah having crutches, times when Dominic's fussy, um, especially how he doesn't, when he gets out in crowds and certain things um, he has a hard time with. The, the older he gets, I'm noticing. And then with Lily, when she's tired, she's not really fussy, but she's very loopy. She's just crazy so it does come in handy because i definitely can't be walking around walmart with josiah and crutches <laughs> so that being said i know y'all i put my foot in my mouth but i am kind of loving grocery pickup so um and y'all see uh this wasn't a part of grocery pickup but i had got me some starbucks okay <laughs> i'm gonna start off with the thing that's not on the table so i don't forget I got a huge thing of the Great Value um, water. I had not had a bottle, bottle 
so yeah we have not had bottle water in a long time and i just noticed we drink it better we've been going through more juice because i've been having to pack the kids more juice they do have sippy cups where i could put water in it but a lot of their cups leak and things like that so i just like having water on deck because we really do love water in this family like even lily and dominic um they're pretty good about drinking water actually i'm very proud of them so i needed some more water um so i got i actually half of this haul like twenty dollars it was sixty dollars uh i want to say like fifteen or twenty dollars of it was drinks so i will explain um, I picked up a thing of Snapple, the peach tea. Josiah and me really like this tea. Um, so I picked up some of that. I just got a small thing of the um, whole milk. I was going to get a gallon, but I am going to get a full, full load when I get, I am ashamed to say, when I get my food stamps and I get my um, check. I already got my check last week, but the week after that, I'm going to combine the two probably and get a really big haul because we are running out of a lot of stuff. Anyways, but I just picked up a small thing of milk. Um, we've been liking bacon more. I will say all of the kids like bacon now, even uh, Dominic. It will kind of, he like chews on it. But it's like the only meat he will tolerate. So I, for like Saturday breakfasts, because we definitely really can't cook it during the week. It's nice to have a big breakfast and have some bacon. The kids really enjoy that. Picked up a thing of cheese sticks. Now, I probably need to get this in Sam's Club, like the big pack. Dominic loves him some cheese stick. And I know too much cheese isn't healthy for you, but compared to what he was, it's, it's healthier than chips probably, y'all. And it's healthier than, like, things like that. So, he's really been liking cheese sticks. I picked up a big thing of the chicken breast tenderloins. I usually, y'all know me, I usually like... I usually like the kind um, that's not frozen, but um, it's just, one, it's cheaper, and two, it'll probably last me a lot longer. So I went ahead and got a thing of that. We needed more lunch meat. I also have half a thing of lunch meat in the fridge. Josiah's been wanting me to make him more home lunches um, since he's been in his cast. So, again, we're going through bread and lunch meat like crazy, like we usually do. Got a, now this they substituted because I ordered a small thing of broccoli and they gave me a big thing of broccoli, which is nice. I'm going to make some, whenever I make chicken, I'm probably going to cook broccoli as a side. Um, the kids have been craving ice cream. Dominic saw an episode on Blippi, for those of you that watch Blippi, about an ice cream truck. And all of a sudden he was like, ice cream, ice cream. And he used to not like the texture of things that were cold, like even cold juice. He'd be like, ah. But he's starting to like it more and starting with ice cream. He really likes it. So I just just for a treat once a week or something on Saturday or Sunday. Okay, Josiah loves him some cranberry juice. He doesn't really like apple. Now I got I accidentally got the cocktail. I don't like getting juice cocktail. I know juice period, if you have too much, is not healthy for you, but I like to get a hundred percent juice if I am going to get juice. I don't like Hawaiian punch. I don't like but, so it's the cocktail, it's, uh, I think it's 27% juice, um, but I thought it was just 100% cranberry juice, not the cocktail, but it'll do, but I usually don't like getting that. Um, we needed some more wipes, I was gonna get the Sam's Club, big thing, um, but I just got this three packs, and honestly, I do like Parent Choice. I don't like Parent Choice diapers for my kids, and nothing's wrong with them. I use Target brand off-brand diapers, um, but I do like the Parent Choice wipes. So I did not know this was going to be this little, y'all. I ran out of cure eggs. I had to pop out my mama coffee thing. You see how big that is? Old school on me. <laughs> but I needed coffee, so I had to pull it out. But that being said, I do want to go back to my cure egg. Um, so, but I really thought this was good. This was $10. I thought it was going to be a little bigger. Guess not. These things are expensive. <laughs> I picked up a little thing of eggs. Now, these were only 98 cents. I'm pretty impressed because they're all, they all look really nice. You know, they're not the fancy kind, but they'll do. Um, I may start getting this brand more often. Yogurt. Obviously, I'm trying to save money. Um, I usually get, like, y'all know the kind of yogurts I get if you watch this. The Greek 
strawberry cheesecake flavored or the um, Oreo and M&M's for the kid yogurt, the Yo Play. Um, I usually get like the individual things they can carry to school. But I just got one big tub. I don't know how long it's going to last us. And then I have containers to put for their lunches and for breakfast and things like that. Who knows? I'm, I might actually like this better. It may go a further away. But let me tell you guys. When I got that Sam's Club big thing of yogurt. And I was like, hmm, I hope it doesn't go bad. It did not go bad. It, it, I actually went through it faster than I thought I would. Um, I think I went through it like a week before I thought I would. Dominic had some, Lily had some, Josiah had some. So, yeah, yogurt is lately becoming a, a trend all over again in my house. We go through phases. <laughs> um, now, I like great value, but usually on my bread, I do get nature's own honey wheats. But I'm saving money, so I got the great value, the white. Now, I like it, it's just... Um, like when I spread the mayonnaise or peanut butter and jelly, sometimes it breaks the bed bread easily, but we'll see. Um, okay, so I'm trying to save money and have quick, cheap meals this week. I'm just being honest. So I got hot dog buns and I forgot the hot dogs. Okay, so if I have time this week and we want a hot dog night, I'm going to have to run to the store and get a cheap thing of hot dogs. That was funny though. Okay, so I wanted some cereal. I was going to get the off-brand Great Value cereal, but that was honestly... And I realized that my kids don't have a whole bunch of cereal anyways. They probably have it, I want to say, some weeks, only once a week. Um, maybe two or three, but for the most part, not a lot. And they all like different kinds, so I thought this would be kind of cool. Kind of reminds me of things that I had. Apple Jacks, Cocoa, Frosted, Fruit Loops. Lily would probably like the Fruit Loops. Um, and the Kellogg Pops. Josiah probably like the Cocoa Krispies. They didn't have Cinnamon Toast Crunch, but that's okay. So yeah, I thought something new to try with the kids because cereal's not the biggest thing we go through in our house. So, although during the summer we kind of did, like I would force the kids, like, look y'all, I'm not making a big breakfast every single day. You're going to have to settle with something um, easy other than toaster strudels and breakfast sandwiches so but that being said they don't eat a whole lot of cereal i picked up this big thing of doritos the party mix the cool ranch now i know you guys have been thinking i'm saving money i've been getting great value everything why did i get the regular doritos this dominic used to love all kinds of chips this has been the only kind he's been eating lately when we usually get the variety pack. And I didn't know that, first of all, I didn't see the, Great Value does have an off brand of this, but I didn't see it. And second, I didn't know if he would like the taste of it. So I just picked up some of these, so. Now Lily, she'll eat any kind of chip, y'all, practically. She is a chip queen. So I got some of these Zesty Ranch veggie straws. I think she really enjoyed these. And I got the Great Value Sour Cream and Onion. Um, so yeah, I can't believe I'm already done. I'm usually still doing hauls for days, y'all. <laughs> and I still have some of those apples. Believe it or not, they are good. They're not molded. Um, I still have some frozen fruit in the fridge. I still have some mandarin oranges. But for $60, I thought this was pretty good. Plus my Starbucks. Um, <laughs> So if you watch, thanks for watching, and I will start coming out with some more videos. And I promise the next big, big, big haul I do, which is probably coming soon in the next couple weeks, I will um, videotape it. Um, because, yeah, my kids are going through things like crazy with all of them going to school. And just getting older, too. With them just getting older, Dominic's starting to eat more things other than, like, his one or two items he used to have. Um, so yeah, but thanks for watching. Bye! Dominic! Say hi! Show them your Blippi shirt!